The 2024 United States presidential election takes place on Tuesday, November 5, 2024, when Americans elect the 47th president. America is the world's oldest modern democracy and the most powerful country, so quite naturally, every country is concerned with who will be the next president of the United States of America. Currently, the numbers are not stacked in favor of the 46th president, Joe Biden, and his approval ratings are way below the challenger, former President Donald Trump. At 81, Biden is the oldest US president to hold office, and the questions have been raised about his stamina and mental sharpness. Why isn't Biden ready to opt out of the race? Is Donald Trump poised to win? What does Trump's assassination attempt mean for United States politics? What does the approval polling tracker say? This is Quick Take, your quick guide. I'm Smita Prakash. Biden's frequent gaps. As of July 2024, President Joe Biden's approval ratings are notably lower compared to former President Donald Trump. Biden's approval rating stands at approximately 37%, while Trump leads in several key polls. After June 27th debate, Trump surged ahead and Biden dipped significantly in the polls. The Democratic Party is in a fix and are unable to turn the narrative around that Trump's criminal charges are worse than Biden's age factor. The American public don't seem to be buying into that. Biden looks confused and vulnerable. There have been several gaffes in the past month. At the NATO summit, Biden mistakenly referred to Zelensky as Russian President Putin. Then he referred to Kamala Harris as Vice President Trump at a press conference. He misreads the teleprompter repeatedly. Democrats want Biden out. Biden is also facing increasing pushback from within his party. 20 Democrats in the Congress have publicly urged President Joe Biden to end his presidential bid. A new poll found that 65% of Democrats want President Joe Biden to end his campaign and allow his party to select a new nominee. Former President Donald Trump doesn't fare much better. About 57% of adults say that Trump should withdraw and allow Republicans to select a new nominee. The assassination attempt on Trump and its effect. On July 13, 2024, Trump faced an assassination attempt during a rally in Pennsylvania. According to Polymarket, a political prediction platform, Trump's chances of winning has hit 70% an 8% increase, marking his highest point ever. On the other hand, the Biden administration is under scrutiny for how it's dealing with the political violence and security issues in the country. Why is Biden not opting out? In the history of the United States of America, no president has been pressured out of a re-election campaign out of concerns about his mental fitness. It's not unprecedented for an incumbent president to abandon his re-election campaign, but it's rare. Presidents usually prefer to run for re-election and then leave office voluntarily. Biden-Trump best options. The United States, which often lectures other countries on democracy and governance, has seen four presidents assassinated in its history. And this July came a fraction away from seeing the assassination of a former president and current contender. Many Americans feel that they are stuck with two bad choices. The same candidates, two men, who've been presidents before running for office yet again. A Pew Research Center study highlights that 65% of Americans feel persistently drained and exhausted when thinking about politics. Only a small fraction believe the political system functions well, with most expressing little confidence in its future.